Creating amazing YouTube videos takes more than just a great camera and an idea. Your editing software plays a huge role in bringing your content to life. But with so many options out there, how do you choose the best video editing software for your needs? In this video, I'll break down some of the top tools for editing YouTube videos, whether you're a beginner, an intermediate, or a pro. I'll also share a web-based editor that I personally love, which is perfect for streamlining your editing process, and it even has AI tools to speed things up. Let's dive in. Before choosing a software, here are some things that you need to ask yourself. What is your skill level? Do you need advanced features like color grading and motion graphics, or are basic cuts and text overlays enough? Are you editing solo or are you collaborating with others? These answers are going to guide you in finding the right software for your goals. So note down everything that you're looking for and then you'll be able to filter it down from there. If you're just starting out, you want to keep it simple. Look for tools that are easy to learn but still powerful enough to grow with you. A couple of options are iMovie, which is great for Mac users. It's free and it's beginner friendly and it's really good for just creating clean, straightforward edits. And the other one is Riverside. This is my top pick for beginners and intermediate creators. It's a web-based platform that combines high quality recording and an easy to use editor. So more on that one shortly. If you've mastered the basics, it's time to level up. These tools offer more creative freedom. DaVinci Resolve is excellent for things like color grading and advanced editing, and it has a free version which is packed full of features. And then again, Riverside is not just for beginners, it has a lot of built-in AI tools to make editing faster, and this is going to help you focus on your creativity rather than those tedious tasks. For full creative control and high-end projects, these are the go-to choices. Adobe Premiere Pro, this is like the industry standard, it has a lot of robust tools for editing and motion graphics, and it's even good for team collaborations. Final Cut Pro has a lot of powerful features and it has an ecosystem that makes it a really good choice for professionals. Okay, so I recommended Riverside twice, both for beginners and intermediates. You could also use Riverside if you're advanced as well because it has tons of the features that you need to streamline your workflow. So let's talk about it a little bit. This is an all-in-one platform that combines recording, editing, and even cloud storage in one place. Whether you're recording a solo video, or you're interviewing guests, or maybe you're creating tutorials, Riverside makes it easy to produce that high quality content. And its editor is a game changer for YouTubers. Here's why, cloud-based storage. So your videos are stored online, so it's not clogging up your computer. And then it's also very easy to collaborate on because the videos are online. It features AI enhanced editing, so you can do things like remove filler words and silences or background noise or echo. It has this new kind of editing called text-based editing, and you can edit your videos by deleting text from the transcript. So this takes away that need for skimming through footage and you can trim out mistakes really quickly. You can auto-generate captions to boost accessibility and engagement and even brand them to fit your style. So with Riverside, you can create polished YouTube videos without spending hours learning those advanced editing softwares. So all in all, if you are looking for the best video editing software for YouTube, it comes down to your goals and your workflow. Platforms like Riverside make editing accessible and efficient. And then there's options like Premiere Pro and Final Cut Pro, which give you ultimate creative control. So if you want to give Riverside a try, I have linked it in the description of this video. And I also linked a playlist of tips to help you get started. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next week.